YouTuber Bob fans. It's your friendly neighborhood Crazy Bob here coming at you. Well, today I thought I would share some insight and dive deep into the thoughts of me, aka Bob. Yep, so hold on to your hats, strap in the walrus, put the kitty litter on the popsicles, and brace yourselves because here we go. First, let me introduce you to someone I find near and dear to me. This is Bob. Now, Bob is not your ordinary guy, by no stretch of anyone's imagination does Bob do ordinary things. Quite the opposite. So picture, if you will, a normal day with all life's business, craziness, and sometimes stress. Then imagine how you like to unwind after such a day. Well, consider, if you will, this is how Bob likes to unwind from a long day of riding a moped delivering shredded newspaper to hamsters. Bob likes to go down to the local boardwalk and walk on boards. Then Bob, with his excellent vision, notices a fish. Yep, you heard right, a fish. It's the kind without tartar sauce. So Bob, being the tired, stressed out guy he is after a long day and seeing that fish, Bob decides to seize the opportunity given to him. That's right. Bob walks over to the fish and starts slapping him. Mm-mm, good. No better way to blow off steamed vegetables than to go fish slapping. There you go, sports fans. That is an in-depth look into the mind and thoughts of your friendly neighborhood, Bob. The more you know. Ding. So the next time the man has got you down and stressed out, just do what Bob does. Find yourself a fish, minus the tartar sauce, and start slapping your cares away. Anyway, I'm Crazy Bob, and I'll leave you with this last thought. If you find yourself locked in a room with no key, that means you're in a room that is locked. Better start looking for a window. Okay, sports fans. I'm Crazy Bob, and I'm out the window because the door's shut, probably locked. I knew I should have had Rochester show me how to pick a lock to C4. Later, peeps. Disclaimer. No walruses, or walrus eye, or walrus fee, or anywho, no walruses were harmed in the making of this video. Yes, fish may have been slapped, not harmed, but no walruses were harmed either. They may have had their teeth brushed. You know, those big white Tuskegee, Tusky, Tisk, Tisk, Tusk things. They're probably nice and shiny now. Anywho, I'm out. Later.